wanted to talk about this for quite a while, but I've been having issues with my health for probably the last few years now. And you know, being only 34 years old, um, I do feel like I should have a lot more energy just when I wake up in the morning and just throughout our daily routines. Um, but I find that I have a lack of energy and I'm getting sick more often. And so in a means to counterbalance that, uh, me and Aud have been doing some research on going to more of a plant-based diet. And the research is showing just phenomenal results on how people with high cholesterol and diabetes and different diseases like that are able to cure it by actually using food as the cure and not having to rely so heavily on drugs, on populated drugs that is normally prescribed by most doctors. And so we're actually gonna make a change going into this year to go. Welcome back to another episode of Empire Your Life. And we have a very, very special episode today where I am joined by none other than the lovely, the fit, the faithful, and the fearless mom, Audrey Horn. And so I'm so excited to have her here today. And we're going to be talking about a topic that most people probably try to avoid, but we're going to be talking about plant-based diets. So a little background on me. So, you know, a big thing for me to look to start getting into more of a plant-based type diet is I've always suffered with my cholesterol being super, super high. Um, I actually got diagnosed with hereditary cholesterol uh, a couple years ago, and it's been so bad at times that my cholesterol as a 33, 34-year-old male is that of a 400-pound, 80-year-old guy to where my numbers came out to be in the mid 300s. I was getting cholesterol ratings, and this is without medication and just a regular diet, regular workout program, just like recommended by you know all the big box stores and, and what everybody recommends as far as the professionals. But getting, getting numbers at around 350 at my age is ridiculous. And so I went down this path of you know, seeing different doctors and actually getting on statins, you know, different cholesterol medicines to try and lower it. And what I found, long story short, is that over all these years of taking these statins and these cholesterol drugs, I have still been unable to actually get it under 200 into a healthy range, which yeah, is super, yeah, super yeah, disappointing yeah, because, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, we don't go eat fast food every night, you know, and we actually do work out, you know, if not five, six days a week, sometimes seven times a week, we're at least getting you know a good sweat, getting out of breath, getting that workout in. And so you know we're living healthy lives, but my cholesterol numbers and my health is not reflecting that. And so that's a big reason for me to actually move forward with a plant-based diet and really just give it a shot and see what it can do for my overall health. And another thing too that you know, we talk about all the time is, is just my overall energy level. I just find that, you know, at my age and my fitness level and everything going on, I feel like my energy level should be so much higher. And I just feel like at times that, you know, it's, it's hard to get up in the morning or, you know, in the evenings, I, I start to feel like I need to take a nap. I am 34 years old. I do not need to take a nap in the afternoon. We put him down with the kids. <sighs> yeah, <laughs> it is nice. It does feel nice. But, you know, it shouldn't be that way. You know, I, I should be in the prime of my life. I should feel fantastic from the time I wake up to the time I go to sleep. And just to have all that energy to, you know, spend time with the family, with the kids, and be able to run around with them. Have the energy to be able to work on the businesses and be able to grow them the way that we should. Well, you know, with the cholesterol and the way the health has been for me, I feel like I haven't been able to be, be the best version of myself. And so I, I really think by doing this plant-based diet, based on the few things that we've watched, it seems like the research points in the direction of not only lowering cholesterol, but actually improving your entire health and just more energy, feeling better, and also lowering your risk of cancer, diabetes, and all of these big ticket type items that you know everybody, you know, including myself, is so concerned about as we get older. And so if we have the availability to treat ourselves now with something as simple as food, 
So this isn't extra medications or anything that you have to take. The actual medicine is the food itself that we eat and that we consume and put in our bodies every single day. And I think some of you have even seen, it's the quote by Hippocrates that says, let food be thy medicine. And so we're actually going to make a change going into this year to go to more of a plant-based diet and we're going to go all in. So for the first three months of this year, for the first 90 days, we're going to go fully plant-based and we're going to be tracking our results from day one all the way to day 90 to see how our numbers change, how our energy changes and overall just you know going through this whole experiment how we feel at the end of it and I'm really hoping that the research that we've been reading about we find for ourselves that it also has the same impact in our life as well and so I'm actually we are just finishing a shopping trip at Costco where we went and picked up all plant-based items which you can see behind me here uh, fruits vegetables um, different kind of wild rices and things like that that we can eat as well and so I'm very excited to jump into this diet and see all the benefits that we're gonna be able to get to it. And so um, if you have any thoughts or experience or anything you would like to share about a plant-based diet, please leave a comment below. I would love to hear about it. Um, and especially as this is a new journey for us, I know we have a lot to learn, um, but I'm excited to go down this path and just excited to have better health and more energy and to be able to enjoy life that much more. And so as always, go out there and build your empire. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Empire Your Life. I hope you enjoyed all these great nuggets about having a plant-based diet and starting to work on your health from an eating perspective and actually using food as the medicine instead of relying on all those medications. Oh. So thank you so much. Thanks. Remember, tap that subscribe button, tap that notification bell, click the links in the description box below, and we will see you next time.